So, what's up guys, Boom Pregnant here, with a kind of a different thing. We're going to be playing a, um, a visual novel off of Steam called The Sword of Asumi. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that correctly. Uh, oh, uh, you can full screen. Okay, this is better for me. Um, F key. There we go. And, um, yeah, um, we're going into this blind. Uh, I know that you can uh, get information about the characters on the codex here, but... I decided not to read into that because it'd take quite a while and I want to surprise myself. So we're going into this blind. I know that we're a female character, so this will be interesting. So many years ago, a great rebellion took place between the Shogunate and the Emperor of Japan. The Civil War took many lives on both sides, but eventually the samurai of the Shogunate rose victorious. Ah, okay, so we've got a little menu icon. Okay, there's kind of just space yes yeah, good if the mic sounds fuzzy it's uh crap mic i'm sorry i need to get a new one um since then the empire was renamed Edo in honor of its capital city and the samurai claimed the streets for themselves keeping the peace via a group of exceptionally talented warriors known as the justicars until recently only the highest of noble families could submit their members for inclusion in the ranks but now, after a decree by the Lord Regent himself, others could finally apply to join this prestigious corps. Okay. Including Assassins of the Black Clan. Right. Okay. So they seem to be the bad guys. Black Clan, I guess, maybe. I have arrived. Oh, I should do a female voice. No, no, no. As much as I would like to try, I'm not very good for female voices. Considering the job, I was expecting more guards and some better locks. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah I'll just do in my normal voice. I made. What was that? Who's there? Okay, this is shady. Uh, in the night, chill. A cloaked figure steps from the shadows. So that's a girl as well. Cloaked intruder. H who are you? D -d Don't come any closer. I have no interest in you. My business is elsewhere. Yes, yes. Uh, b b business What's the meaning of this? That's between me and Lord Kasai. Okay. Wait a minute. You, you're, you're an assassin. Assassino, assassino. No, it's just an assassin's screen. Uh, oh, Lord Kasai. I'll alert the authorities. So, oh, 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 uh, but. Kill or disable? I didn't think I'd get a choice this dire later on. Well, disabling her. We're not We're not an evil person. We're not killing. I don't know what we're doing here. Oh. The maid crumbles, crumples like a ragdoll. Instantly unconscious. Okay, so she was taking a tea. A gl glass of tea. A cup of tea to the master. Okay, she's not dead. We just knocked her unconscious. That's good. Satisfied. The cloaked figure slinks through the kitchen door and up the stairs into the hallway. Yet another obstacle awaits above. A guard stationed outside Lord Kasai's bedroom leaps up as a mysterious, stranger's, a mysterious stranger approaches. Who the hell are you? Get back! Dot, 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 dot. I'm here to see the Lord. Stand aside. Over my dead... <clears throat> over my dead body. Okay, because cause you said over your dead body, I'm assuming I can't disable you, so you, you're dying. You're, just because just you're cocky. Uh, very well. I want to see what happens if we kill someone. Right, okay, so it's all bloody. Rebuilt in 1836. Huh, interesting. Uh, with a flick of the cloaked figure's wrist, the guard crumples. Oh, are we an assassin from the Assassin's Order? Is this Assassin's Creed? Do we just have, like, a hidden blade somewhere? Um, the shadow steps over the guard's lifeless body and enters the Lord's chamber. Well, what's this? How do you get in here? Before Lord Kasai has time to say more than that, the cloaked figure silences him forever. So we're gonna kill someone eventually. Might as well kill the guard as well. <laughs> That's bad justification. Um, barely waiting for his last gasp, she leaves the dead body yeah, she leaves the dead lord in his room alone. Yeah, we knew it. Female. That blatant hairstyle. Those those braids. My work here is done. Dot, dot, dot. 
I feel another pre another presence. A second guard? No, that's a woman. As if on command, another shadowy figure slides into view. Who are you? Show yourself. Stand down, Asumi. Oh, okay. It's only me. Okay, okay. so this is us, I assume. We're Asumi. And this must be... Kami? What's a Justicar doing here? It seems you had no trouble with this particular mission. So I'm guessing she's our boss? Of course not. This was child's play. A playful smile plays across Kami's lips as she lets out a short laugh. Right, okay. Oh, really? Typical assassin arrogance. I was raised by the Black Clan. I am anything but typical. So we're the Black Clan. Okay, so, so we're the good bad guys? We're the good bad guys, and she's a Justica. Okay. Well, you certainly are efficient. It doesn't look like those you spared will be waking up anytime soon. What's your point? In quite a hurry, aren't we? Well, don't let me keep you any longer. Dot, dot, dot. Well? I'm here to brief you on a very important mission. A mission? For the Justicars? Wait a minute. Are we doing some shady work for the good guys? Quite so. I'm sure you've heard about the rebel group called Orochi. They've been dead set on overthrowing the government. Okay, so Orochi are the bad guys. The Black Khan are good. Kind of. Um, I've heard of them. Nothing comes to mind. Um, we're going to act smart here, as, even though I have no idea who they are. I've heard of them. Yes, rumours have been spreading recently. Then you should also know they are highly dangerous and must be stopped at all costs. All costs, huh? What does that have to do with me? Am I going to kill another member? In a manner of speaking, yes. I've been following leads on them for quite some time, systematically raiding their safe houses. In one of them, we've found evidence that Orochi is planning a massive terrorist attack sometime soon. Oh yeah! We're gonna fight terrorism as a Japanese schoolgirl. And who's behind it? That's the problem, we don't know. Aside from a code name, Raven, everything regarding this particular member was erased. Except for one thing, that is, Battle Academy. B -b battle Academy? Sounds like a two-bit karate dojo. Oh, lovely. Great, so I'm assuming we're gonna infiltrate the school. <laughs> not quite. Battle Academy is one of the most prestigious post-university training grounds in Edo. The most skilled martial artists are sent there to hone their physical and mental skills and becoming true samurai before accepting placements. Yeah, what does that have to do with me, an assassin? I'm, I'm not. I'm no samurai. I'm, th this is this is post-university. I didn't accept more training. Come on. So I have to fight samurai. That should be no challenge at all. Wow. So we're cocky. Uh, yeah, don't be so cocky. These fighters aren't like typical thugs and maids you've encountered as a... I just remember the maid we knocked out. In fact, some of them might even be better than you. But why would the rebel be in a school of all places? I'm, I'm probably going to just like try and normalize my voice here. Your guess is as good as mine. Perhaps they're targeting an instructor instructor or a member could be posing as a student of the samurai arts to infiltrate the government I don't know and I don't care so why are you bringing this to me if you don't know and you don't care Jesus Christ the intelligence says Raven is there and we need to stop him you're, ass you're assuming it's a him it might be a female assassin it might you know you never know or her. Okay. Uh, I should just read first before fucking making an assumption. Uh, do I do that? I guess. Let's carry on. That's all we need to care about. So I just find this raven. Get in and get out, right? Not quite. There's always more with you, isn't there, miss? There's always more. As I said, we don't know who Raven is or what he looks like. Now he's a he, is he? You said he or she before. Come on. All right, what he looks like. We need to find out. 
I've been able to obtain a position in the academy as an instructor, but Orochi knows my face, along with most of Edo, so it would be pointless to hide my position as a Justicar. So what you're saying is, you need, you need a shadow ally, right? You need someone in the shadows. With myself there, prominently displayed, I believe Orochi will think of me as their only f Yeah, you, yeah, yeah, only threat. So, I'm your shadow buddy, okay. But you won't be. Indeed, that's where you come in. You'll go undercover as a first year student. How did I know that we were going to be a high school student, aka post-university student? What? We look like we're in high school. How are we post-university? Oh well. Under that guise, you can interact with students and instructors to, instructors to find the identity of Raven. So, this is like, uh identify the criminal type of scenario. I don't like this. That doesn't sound like my sort of mission. I'm an assassin, not some happy-go-lucky student. Well, you're certainly young enough to play the part. Am I? How old am I? Tell me. I said no, I don't like mingling with other people. I see, I thought you wanted to become a Justicar. Uh, nanny? You heard me. Prove yourself in this, and who knows what could happen. But I was told that we aren't recruiting. That's what we tell everyone, at least. But every so often, we handpick some special and someone special and give her a chance to prove herself. Are just the cars only females? Or are you just insinuating that I'm the special one this time around? And this is my chance? Exactly. Prove you're more than a sword to be pointed in the right direction. Go to the academy, locate the threat, and then eliminate it. Sounds simple, doesn't it? Haha. <laughs> right. Be more than an executioner, otherwise you can never be a justicar. An executioner? It's not enough for a justicar to be a killer. Without mercy, a justicar can never fulfill her duty. Espionage and subtlety are important skills in our work. Skills you have not yet demonstrated. Oh, uh, 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 wait, I'm just gonna save. Can can I just, no, uh, ah, no. No, can we go back? No, no, okay, quick save. I'm gonna make that up, so, so I need to learn is what you're saying. I'm gonna make up that last line. Uh, take it as you will. Would you rather be a Justicar who fights evil or an assassin for hire? You made your intentions clear when you tried to join us, but now is your time to put your dedication to the test. Great, so then I have no other option. Very well then, Madame Cammy. I knew you'd come around. We'll make a proper woman out of you yet. Proper? Aren't I proper already? Jesus. Let's see, how long do we want to make this episode? So let's do this first scene and then we'll finish the episode off. Are you implying that I'm lacking in a few places, actually? Oh my god, she went there. Just because my chest is small. Come on. Come on. A few! Oh, forget it. Am I to leave in the morning? Right. Pack light. Here's the basic info on the location. I'll contact you after you arrive. So she's our boss. Wait, Cammy! But the just car was already gone. With a sigh, Asami prepared to go. This is going to be a long few days, to be sure, but if this is what it takes to become a true just car, then so be it. After all, how terribly difficult can a bunch of samurai trainees really be compared to an assassin? I know there's a romance aspect, so that's probably the difficulty. Okay, so we finished that first act. I'm gonna end the episode here. Um, Anyway, uh, like, comment, and subscribe. I'd love your feedback in the comments. I'd, I'll be reading them. Um, especially if it's mic-related or how to read these more effectively. If I should put on voices or not. Or if I should keep reading it in my normal voice or reading it smoother for different characters. But anyway, this is Boom Pregnant with the first part of The Sword of Asami. Um, and I hope you enjoyed. And just quick save here, and Boom Pregnant, signing off.